KG5 EIU. I'm going to show you how to upgrade the firmware in your Cisco SPA 525G2 phone for the Hamshack hotline. Let's get started. First thing you want to do is make note of the hardware you're running. You can web into your phone that's on your local area network. Check the product name and the current version here highlighted. And also make note if you're running Bluetooth. My phone happens to have Bluetooth in it and uh, we'll need to know this for later on. So if you go out to the Google site and you Google around, you'll eventually come to a, a download site here. And uh, we want the small business uh, SPA 500 series phones. And I'm running the 525G2 here. So uh, I'll pick that download. And after I download it, it comes down as a zip file and, and there's two files in here. There's a image, uh, there's the firmware image with BT for Bluetooth and there's an image in there uh, without a BT. Uh, that means no Bluetooth. Since I have Bluetooth, uh, I'll be using the Bluetooth image to update the firmware in my phone. So after I have it downloaded and I've unzipped it, the next thing to do is actually upload it and uh, update the phone with it. We'll look across the top here. We'll see the firmware upgrade uh, location. We'll click the firmware upgrade window. We'll go choose the file. And there's the two files that we've downloaded. Remember, I'm running Bluetooth here, so I'm going to upgrade. I'm going to select the Bluetooth image to upgrade it. We'll also upgrade the Bluetooth uh, equipment as well inside the phone. So we'll go ahead and open that. And we have the file loaded, and we'll hit submit and off we go so i'm doing this live uh it may take here a little bit we'll see how well how well how long it goes as i recall it doesn't go too long but we'll just let it run here for a little bit we'll get a firmware upgrade successful message at the end of it we'll close it out and that's it it's just that easy to upgrade the firmware. We'll do a quick reboot on the phone, and when it all comes back up, everything should be there and in order, and you'll have the latest and greatest firmware. Okay, the phone's rebooted, and you can see after the reboot, the firmware file that we uploaded, some 62 f you have the latest and greatest. Uh, the 762 f firmware came out December 10th of 2020. 7-3 from KG5 EIU.